Yay! So it's the Ask Orth Omnibus. Um, so let's get started. The first question comes from Pacifist, and he says, I've often wondered if I should be helpful and pick up the odd hitchhiker here and there. Should I really be worried about crazies, or should I trust in the kindness of strangers and give a lift? Depends. Hot chick? Don't pick him up. That's the beginning of every single horror movie. If it's an old guy, long white beard, go ahead, give him a lift. But if it's a middle-aged guy with a scruffy beard, don't even, don't even think about it. Just keep on driving. Small gas. Is it indeed better to burn out than fade away? I don't think either is appropriate. I think it is better to die tragically. Look at all of our, uh, our, our famous people. You got uh, Abraham Lincoln shot in the back. JFK, John Lennon, shot and assassinated, and we remember them. Uh, Lady Di died horribly in a car wreck. Michael Jackson, I'm not going to do what you think I'm going to do here and make a little, you know, <laughs> little boys have AIDS kind of joke. Um, the guy was just kind of screwed up. Awesome, but a little screwed up, and he died. Patrick Swayze. Aberrant said, is this a great thread or the greatest thread? And that has yet to, to be determined. I, I can't answer that. Annabelle Lee asks, should I let my tortoise eat all of the puppy chow since she's torn open the bag and slobbered on it anyhow? Should turtles really be eating puppy chow? I don't really know anything about turtles, but it sounds like they would want, you know, lettuce and strawberries. Turtles love strawberries. One Thursday ask, Orith, what action star do you think you most resemble? <laughs> I'm not so sure he's an action star, but the main character from Angus. Endless Harlequin asks, why do men have nipples? I, I don't have a good answer for that. Because later, if they want to become women, they need to have them. Also, for erogenous zones. Omnihound, if you could be any tree, what kind of tree would you be? I don't know anything about botany. No, I don't have a good answer. He also asks, which would you rather have, a tail or the gift of flight? Flight. What, what the hell would I use a tail for? Thormeister, would you have sexual intercourse with Lady Gaga? Or am I the only one who wouldn't touch her with a 10-foot barge pole? I don't need to know anything about your barge pole. I might watch, but actually participate... Eh, I've seen all the things she's humped, and uh, no, no, maybe. Blackjack, I want to become a super poster, but I lack audio-visual equipment for wacky videos. What are my options? I have a Mac Mini uh, that I use. Uh, right now I'm recording using Photo Booth, the video option on Photo Booth. And I'm using the Xbox Live Arcade camera and this handy-dandy rock band mic. All in all, let's see, $400 for the Mac Mini, $30 for the camera. Get one of these for cheap. USB mic. But you'll never be a super poster. Bloody Jack says, what would the internet be like if 4chan never existed? My life would be empty. Dean asks, why can't I come up with a question worthy of this video? You did. I read it out loud, and now I'm answering it. It's very kind of Douglas Hofstetter-esque, I'd, I'd guess. Goat boy, for you personally, me, what was the best TV show that got prematurely canceled? Don't say Firefly, you fucking brown coat ass munch. Uh, I think the first TV show that I ever saw that I was like, holy crap, this is great TV, and I feel that got taken off the air too soon, and uh, Aaron Sorkin Sports Night, I absolutely loved it. I haven't seen uh, West Wing, really want to. Judd Apatow's Freaks and Geeks got canceled way too soon. White Room asks, to be or not to be? Um, I would say the answer is to be. Not being doesn't sound like very much fun. Regardless of how much fun one has in his life, being implies that you are experiencing things. And that is the culmination of humanity is experience. So, to be. Wu asks, here's my question. Where's the damn video? Right here. I got your damn video right here. Imagine me grabbing my crotch because the video doesn't actually go all the way down. Andreas asks, why? Well, I think I answered that previously with the to be or not to be. Uh, to experience things. To enrich yourself. Why not? Prince Ali asks, what's the deal with Street Fighter? Quarter circle forward punch. Hadouken. Jaga asks, swine flu or avian flu? Avian flu is old hat. Swine flu is the new hotness.
Riot asks a very great question. Classic Sega versus classic Nintendo. Who is better? That's a simple uh, Nintendo. The only thing I played with any regularity on the Genesis was NBA Jam, which was hardcore awesome. The only thing that came out of that that was good was the Saturday morning Sonic cartoon. Now, there were two versions of that. There was the really, really kind of low production, and then there was the high quality one. It had uh, Princess Sally, Tails, Bunny. I forget what the Blue Walrus guy's name was, but he was in that. Uh, Knuckles came in later, and it was kind of dark. Uh, it was a darker show and a lot more serious. When you go for the classic systems, uh, Nintendo, uh, Super Mario 1, 2, and 3 are all still fantastic games. I'm going to be a heathen here and say that number 2 was my favorite. And yes, I know it was based on Doki Doki Panic and Nintendo bought it because they didn't think that Americans would appreciate the difficulty of what was truly Super Mario 2, which was later released as the Lost Worlds on the Super Nintendo and Super Mario All-Stars. So, Nintendo. I'm in Jester. If the world were to end, how would you prefer that it do so? I want the world to explode. I want to be on a piece of the earth that get it thrown into space, and I'm sitting there trying to breathe in, and it's the vacuum of space, but I get to see the stars. I think that would be awesome. Plastic Wildlife asked, how's my posting? Having a clue. I don't know who you are. Sorry. Nomad asks, why do I not post more? Because you're busy? Because the forums aren't the end-all, be-all of everything? Just don't enjoy the the uh, tenor of the clientele here. I, I don't know. I'm not a mind reader. But that would be awesome if I was. Omnihound asks, What Star Trek android would you rather be, Data or Lore? Uh, I like to go with the classic. I'll go with Data. I mean, lore had more abilities, uh, the wider sense of human emotions, and but I, as I recall, he was kind of a dick. And uh, bite sized dragon asks, "What's the best item on Taco Bell's menu?" I actually swore off Taco Bell some time ago. Um, it never ever ended well, gastrointestinally. When I go there, one of my favorite things to get is the tostada. It's like an 89, 89 or 99 cent menu item. The thing that makes it special is the red sauce. If you don't get it with red sauce, you got gypped. Goat Boy asks, If you could ship one porn star to visit your best bud for some real hot nasty banging, who would it be? This could be a tool of malice or a tool of benevolence. For the purposes of this, let's assume that Goat Boy is my best bud here. Goat Boy, I would send you... I would send you Cytheria. Post-pregnancy. Make sure to lay down plastic. <laughs> on everything. <laughs> Analyzer has a small omni omnibus of his own. He says, want to move to Tahoe with me in January? Yeah, sure. But I need to give somebody some emergency contact info. Uh, do I have crabs? Nope. As far as I know, <laughs> I have never contracted a venereal disease or... Are, are crabs a venereal disease? Uh, whatever crabs are. No. Why do I have to wear pants at work? It's my office. You don't. Uh, Jasper asks, why is this place less interesting than it used to be? I don't know. I, I find I find that it is, in fact, as interesting, if not more so, than what it, what it used to be. It used to be full of poop jokes and dick jokes. Well, maybe that was just from my perspective. I did make a lot of dick and poop jokes. Uh, actually, I find it much more uh, intellectually stimulating than it used to be. Uh, so I don't know what the hell your problem is. Uh, Gracefully Insane says, Do we really exist or are we all just a dream? This is not General Hospital. We are not all just a thought inside of an autistic's head. General Hospital or Dallas? Who shot JR? Who killed Laura Palmer? David Lynch owns. Uh, uh, do we really exist or are we all just a dream? No, we exist. Annabelle Lee, once again, she asks, What is the meaning of life? Registered trademark. And as I can recall, the meaning of life... Actually, the goal of it was to retire and be a millionaire or else you end up in a retirement home. Um, I don't know. I didn't really like that game. You had to put oil on the spinner before it would spin properly and then your sister would cheat and bet on the stock market and then move the thing. No. That's the end of the video.